Welcome to DXP Diecast Racing. Today we're going to put some cars on the track that are some of everybody's favorites. You either love them or you hate them. The Faster Than Ever. Ultra Fast Wheels. Let me show you some that I've got here. I'm going to have 16 that I've already got opened. And then I'm going to have 16 in packages. So let me show you what we got here that's already opened. We're going to have a 32 car race. First off, the Volkswagen Beetle. Try to get these cars where they won't run off the table on me. Horseplay. Dodge Challenger. Nissan Silva. Dodge Charger Drift Car. You can see some of these FTEs, the later years, came in the uh, Trap 5s. Cars were produced between, I think, 2005 to 2009. There's a Chevy Nova. Bully Goat. We're going to mix fantasy with real cars here. Just trying to find some fast ones. Porsche Carrera. Got a Camaro convertible. A Mustang. Look, that's a, is that a GT? Mustang. A Honda Spocket. Not a sprocket, a Spocket. Paragram shift or paragram shift. Got a ZR1 Corvette. Got a Superbird. Mini Cooper. Some of these are metal on metal like that Mini Cooper and then some of them are plastic on metal like this AMC Javelin. Let me show you some of the ones here that are in the package. Got this Bon Voyage. This was sent to me from your nightmare racing. Really appreciate Bo sending this one to me. This is not one that I had before. Fast Fish. The Audacious. Nineteen seventy one Plymouth GTX. The Dual Fueler, those big back wheels. Whip Creamer 2. Dodge M80 Pickup. The Lotus Esprit. Mustang Fastback. A boombox. Cadillac Escalade. Nineteen 
1970 Chevy Chevelle. Corvette Grand Sport. Straight pipes. Sixty seven Pontiac GTO and to round up the field of thirty two a sixteen angels. So let's put these cars on the track and find out if they truly are faster than ever. Stay with me. All right. All the cars have been dusted up. I'm gonna show you a few things that I have found that are pretty interesting. The heaviest FTE car in this bunch weighs in at 47.06 grams, and that is the Escalade. It seems to be the heaviest one. The next heaviest is the 16 Angels, coming in at 44.86. The only other one that's in the 40s is the boombox. Boombox comes in at 42.91. Those are the three heaviest cars. Most of these cars weigh right between 37 to 34 grams. There is one, the exception. This one right here comes in at 30.84, and that is the that is the uh, Camaro here. So most of them are right in that range, 34, 36 grams, 37. But there are a few exceptions to the rule. Um, another light one is the Audacious. I think it's pretty light too. But otherwise, that's the weight on these cars. Now these FTE cars, before we get started, faster than ever. They have the nickel-plated axles. It allows them, the wheels to spin a little bit faster. And uh, a lot of people really, really, really think that means they are faster than everything else. That is not necessarily the case. Uh, you either love these cars or you hate them. You hate the existence of them. Um, a lot of cool cars, though, in it, in this series. Um, the faster than ever, just because it says faster than ever, don't get caught up on that. They're not always faster than ever. Are they generally fast? Yes. Are they faster than other cars? Not necessarily. I'm not expecting any kind of record-setting performance here from any of these cars, but uh, I do hope we find a little bit of speed. Maybe we can get a few in the case. Just, just going to depend, really. So let's go ahead and get started um, and see what we can find. We have this guy right here. This is the, I believe this is the GTO. Am I right? GTO Pontiac going up against the Corvette. Now I put these in to a separate thing. I put a, I put one that I already had opened against one that was not opened just so we could kind of see what's going to go on. Here at DXP Diecast Racing, we put these cars head to head. We will take the biggest beat. The biggest beat will move forward after we swap lanes. Ready, set, go. Corvette takes the first one. 2243 to a 2303. That is a one and done. Well, we're going to swap lanes because I know this one lane is running just a hair faster. That'll be, uh, what is that, 50, 57, 60 thousandths. 60 thousandths win for the Corvette. Yeah, this one, lane number one is running just a head faster, so we're going to go ahead and swap them. Besides, we're good to see these. FTE cars out here on the track. Ready, set, go. Corvette's definitely a lot faster. 2251 to a 2325. That's a good win by the Corvette. GTO is going back to the box. Corvette will move on. I'm gonna put him over here. We have the Audacious going against horseplay. Now, I've got an audacious already out here in my uh, one of my cases and for his weight class. May get another one out here. Ready, set, go. Oh, audacious pulls around in 2288 to a 2305. It's 
So we got a 17 thousandths beat for the audacious. 17 thousandths, we're gonna swap lanes. Put him over here in lane one, 17 thousandths. Most of these cars have never been on this track before. Ready, set, go. It looks like the Audacious is gonna take it. 2282 to a 2298. So the Audacious is gonna to move to the next round. All horse play. Gonna go right here. We've got the 16 Angels going against the Bully Goat. Bully Goat FTE 32 car race. Kind of curious to see if anything has got any speed. Ready, set, go. 16 Angels takes it with a 2254 to a 2292. Oh, I got to get my math cap going today. That's going to be a 38,000 speed for the 16 Angels. Swap them up. 38,000 beat. Bully Goat going in lane two. 16 Angels in lane one. Ready, set, go. All the way down the hill. 2219. Now that's fast. 2298. That's a fast run for that guy. I've heard he was pretty quick. This is the first time I've actually had a 16 Angels FTE open. We got the Mustang going up against. Oh, what is this guy? The Plymouth GTX, I believe is what that one is. We'll put the Plymouth GTX over here in lane one. And the Mustang in lane two. Ready, set, go. Plymouth GTX takes it. With a 22.52 to a 23.42. Wow, that's a slow time right there. A 42, wow, that's 90 thousandths beat. That Mustang, what in the world's going on? Did you blow a cylinder, buddy? Good grief, that's slow. That's slow, and that's FTE slow, baby. FTE slow. Ready, set, go. Oh, yeah. 2252 to a 2313, a little bit better. But still, GTX is going to take it. Good grief, dude. I'm not really fond of that gold paint either. Superbird versus the Whip Creamer 2. Whip Creamer 2 going over here in lane one. Superbird in lane two. Took a while to get all these cars dusted up, ready to go. But here they are, ready, set, go. Man, that Superbird's got something going on with this front axle. 2276 to a 2558. Yeah. When I did him, he's, I don't know what's going on with him. I don't know what's happening up here, but he is, that's gonna be a one and done. He is not, he didn't graphite, graphite up very well. I don't know what's happened to him, but uh, I got a few more of those. We'll try them later. Not even worth redoing them. All right, we got the Camaro, the lightweight versus the Corvette. I don't know what's going on. I got another one up here, too, that's had some bad wheel work that we'll check him out here in a minute. Ready, set, go. Oh, look at the little lightweight comeback. 2280 to a 2299. Got him by 19,000s, the little lightweight car with those beautiful, fancy trap fives on it. Got a 19,000s beat. Let's see what he does in the other lane. I'm telling you. Trap fives, baby. Yes. Yeah. Ready, set, go. Oh, yeah. He's quick. Quick, 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 quick. 2266 to a 2313. So a little lightweight. Getting her done over the little bit heavier vet. All right. We got the Chevelle going against, this is a metal on metal car right here. This MG is pretty heavy, heavier anyway. We'll see what he does with those little wheels. Ready, set, go. Oh yeah, he got it where he counts. 
2266 to a 2300. So a 34 thousandths beat for this little guy. See, none of these, none of these times are just overwhelming besides that one run by the 16 Angels. So this FTE stuff, is it a marketing gimmick? Are they really faster? <laughs> Ready, set, go. OMG, getting it done right there. 2256 to a 2325. But hey, FTE cars, everybody, you either love them or you hate them. They're interesting anyway. A lot of, no variation. Got the boom box going against the charger. Don't seem to be too much middle ground on these FTEs. I mean, FTEs are all right. They're not bad cars. Cost a little bit more, but ready, set, go. I should say sometimes they cost a little bit more. 2239 to a 2312. Now see, that's a pretty good time right there. Yeah, that ain't that ain't a bad time right there. That's a, uh, let's see, mm, 61 and 73. 73 thousands beat for the charger. These boom boxes, I think they're just too low. I think that's what it is. They kind of kind of tend to want to drag these low riders compared to that charger. Ready, set, go. Oh yeah, that charger. 2242 to a 2306. So the charger with the trap fives doing something. Doing something. All right. You got this right here. This is the, oh, I cannot remember what he's called. It's something crazy, uh, pair, yeah, Peregrim Shift or something like that. Going against the Bon Voyage. Bon Voyage with FTEs. So I'd be curious right here to see what this Bon Voyage can do. Ready, set, go. Not bad, not bad at all. 2256 to a 2301. So we got a 40, what is that, 44, 45 thousandths beat for the Bon Voyage. Now this is pretty cool. Look, it's got a little sail. Pretty cool right there. A little sail comes up. 45,000 <laughs> beat. Pretty cool, a little fantasy car. Oh, me. Yeah, I haven't put a lot of these FTEs out here on the track. I put a few just to see what they would do, but ready, set, go. I haven't done a tournament like this, a 32 car tournament. 2265 to a 2294. So the Bon Voyage, your Nightmare Racing gift, doing pretty well. AMC Javelin versus the truck. Dodge, Dodge truck right here. I've seen this Dodge truck in some races for the last couple years. It can have some quicks to it. Don't know if this one will. Ready, set, go. Uh, apparently not. Uh, AMC Javelin, 2251 to a 2309. So that's a 49, 58 thousandths beat for the Javelin. Got it right there. 58 thousandths beat for the old Javelin. Let's see what happens in this lane over here. Ready, set, go. I'm just gonna stay out in front of it. 2272 to a 2321. So the AMC Javelin, again, trap fives, getting it done over the traditional ones. It's all right. This guy right here, I, uh, Maximum, Maximus, it says it on the side. I don't know if it says down there. Dual, fu dual fuel, excuse me. Never put, never put one of these on the track. Going against the Nissan Silva. Nissan Silva. Oh, me. Let's see what this guy can do with that big old wheel in the back. Ready, set, go. Ooh, not too bad. 2269 to a 2286. So we've got, hmm. 11, 17 thousandths. 17 thousandths beat for the silver. 
Swap them up. 17,000th of dual fueler. Never, never heard of that car before until I got it. Those FTEs. Ready, set, go. Oh, he got him that time. Did he get him by 17? I don't think so. 67, that's 3, 13. Is that a tie? Well, by George, it's a tie. Look at that mess. Is that right? Tie. Here, let's re-race them. 17 thousandths, that one lane. That one lane, 17 thousandths difference right there. Put the Silva back in lane one. Put the dual fueler in lane two. Ready, set, go. Oh, he went around him. Look at that. Working in that graphite. 2275 to a 2295. We got a 20,000 speed. Let's swap them up. 20,000 speed. Right there. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Old fantasy car. Sometimes fantasy cars are fast and sometimes they're not. Ready, set, go. I know a lot of people don't like those either, but you know, it is what it is. 2276, 2285, the dual fueler moving on past the silver. Little Nissan going back home. Got this Lotus right here, Esprit, against the Porsche Carrera. Porsche Carrera over here, lane one. The Lotus in lane two, I've seen that Lotus perform pretty well too. See what happens, ready, set. Go. Well, that one doesn't perform very well. Uh, 2246 to a 2340. Ugh. It's terrible. That is terrible right there. But it is what it is. 94 thousandths. Huh. Oh, well, Lotus. Like I said, some, <laughs> some of these cars are better than others. These FTEs, I'm telling you. You can't really go by the FTE. A lot of people just love them worship them and some people are like yeah i can't stand them ready set go and the truth of the matter is that one gets beat pretty good the truth of the matter is sometimes they're good and sometimes they're not the carrera moving on past the lotus i mean you're going to get good cars and bad cars just depends here's the challenger versus the fast fish Put fast fish over here in lane one. Challenger in lane two. Ready, set, go. Fast fish, 2275 to a 2287. 12,000 beat. Got a fast fish. Yeah, these cars can. When I first started getting into this stuff and found out about FTEs, I was like, like most people, I was like, oh man, FTEs faster than ever. And then you kind of learn, ready, set, go. That sometimes it's just kind of gimmicky. 2277, 2291. Now there are some really fast, as I, as I destroyed that one on the floor, that's what you don't do. Don't do that, people, that's bad. Uh. Fast fish, moving on. Um, sometimes you get cars that are fast and sometimes they're not. Here's a Honda Spocket versus the Twin Pipes. Now this right here is the one, those front wheels on that Twin Pipes just did not, I don't know what the deal is. It's almost like the axle's too short and they're where it's really rubbing or something, I don't know. But it did not do very well. Ready, set, go. Kind of what I thought. 2252 to a 2339. So that's what is that? Uh, 48 and 39 is a lot. 87. 87. So, but then again, you can find some of these FTEs, and every once in a while you'll get one that's pretty fast because they do have the nickel plated axles. Ready, set, go. You know, so there is potential. And a lot of times, too, 2239 to a 2329, a lot of times you gotta, you can take them apart and, you know, 
you can do a little bit of work to them and make them a little bit better. Here's another one, this Mustang versus the Bug. Now this Mustang I've seen do pretty well out there and on people's tracks. Don't know if this one's gonna be fast, but never know. Ready, set, go. Looks like it's a little bit faster. 2279 to a 2297. So that's a uh, 18 thousandths beat for the Mustang. 18 thousandths. For the old FTE. 18 thousandths. Let's see what he does in this lane. Got the small tires versus big tires. Ready, set, go. The small tire is going to win out. 2286 to a 2300. So the Mustang. Kind of cool. I like that white and blue on it. This thing gonna move on. Getting past the bug. Getting past the bug. All right, here's the heavy guy. The Escalade going against the Nova. This may be everybody's pick. These Escalades are known to be pretty quick. Pretty quick. I was trying to buy one one day. Got one in like $16 for one. I was like, you're crazy. Ready, set, go. I think I got this one for like three. 2233 to a 2268. I mean, come on, let's not be ridiculous, people. 35,000's beat for the Escalade. I mean, I know people out here charge a lot of money and it's up to them that they have it. They can charge what they want to, but it's also, if, if you ain't gonna make me a deal, come on now. $16, ready, set, go. I'll find it for cheap. 2236 to a 2270. The Escalade right here. Moving on over the Nova. All right, there's round one. Here's your 16 right here. Let's get to it. Corvette versus Audacious. Maybe we knocked out some of the slow cars. We'll find out. Audacious in lane one. Corvette in lane two. We'll see if we can get a few little better races. Ready, set, go. Corvette, 2251 to a 2286. That's a 35,000's beat right there for the Corvette. 35,000's beat. I'm going to put the Audacious over here and the Corvette over here. Ready, set, go. All the way down the track is the Corvette. Got 32, 34 to a 32, 85. The audacious not getting her done. Get them crazy skulls on there. Put you back over here. Corvette moving on. 16 Angels in the Pontiac. That was a Plymouth. Plymouth, excuse me. GTX. One over here. Ready, set. Go. 16 Angels pulling around him. 2247 to a 2271. That's 32 thousandths. Beat for the 16 Angels. I have heard these 16 Angels are pretty quick. FTE versions anyway. Got a little bit of mass to them. Not disappointing right here. Ready, set, go. There he is right there. 2219 to a 2261. Wow, he really likes that lane. It's two good times in that lane. Wow. Come up. 16 Angels. Whip Kramer 2 going against the lightweight. Old Camaro with the Trap Fives. Can he pull off another win? I'm being lightweight. Let's find out. Ready, set, go. Close race, but he got him 2271 to a 2280. Got him by nine thousandths. The little lightweight going up against the whip creamer two. Whip creamer two right there. All solid white with that red. Look, there's got a little spinny thing back there. I think he can blow it or something. Ready, set, go. And the Camaro went right around him. 2262 to a 2290. Now I'll show you. I don't know. 
See that little spinny thing in there? I guess you can blow it or something. I don't know. And anyway, the Camaro, getting her done. Moving on to the Elite Eight. Anyway, MG versus the Charger. Well, I say it's a Mini Cooper. Excuse me. Mini Cooper versus the Charger right here. Let's see what happens. Ready, set, go. Oh, that's a close race, but the Charger kept him off. 2245 to 2255. Got him by 10 thousandths. Charger, 10 thousandths. Let's see what happens when we swap them up. See what happens when we swap them. Well, trap fives are going today. Oh, trap fives. Ready, set, go. Oh, and he pulled it out. Look at that. 2246 to a 2261. Good job by the Charger. Wow. Oh, little, little bitty tires on that Mini Cooper. All right. Bon Voyage, AMC Javelin. Gonna put that AMC Javelin over here in lane one. Bon Voyage in lane two. Ready, set, go. Ooh, the Bon Voyage went right around him. 22.49 to a 22.90. So it got him by 31, 31 thousands beat for the Bon Voyage. 31 thousands. Put him over here in lane one. AMC Javelin in lane two. Who's it gonna be? Ready, set, go. Got him all the way down the hill. 2258 to a 2282. The Bond Voyage sailing all, going over and around the AMC Javelin. Put him over here. Got this dual fueler versus the Porsche Carrera. Porsche Carrera going in lane one. Dual fueler in lane two. Ready, set. Go. Ooh, he was coming back on him. Porsche Carrera, 2249 to a 2268. 4968, that's a 19 thousandths beat for the Carrera. Let's swap them up. 19 thousandths. Dual fueler over here in lane one. Porsche Carrera in lane two. Let's see what happens. Ready, set. Go. Oh, Carrera got him by two thousandths. Got him by two thousandths. So the Carrera right here. Moving on to the final eight. Put you right there. Fast Fish versus the Honda Spocket. Oh, Honda Spocket. Put him in lane one. Fast Fish in lane two. Grab my string. Ready, set, go. Honda Spocket got him. 2236 to a 2255. Looks like another, was that another 19,000s beat right there? Let's swap them up. Fast Fish. Funny name for a car. But I have seen those guys be pretty quick. Not only FTE version, but some of the other ones for what they are. Ready, set, go. On the spot, it takes it. 2253 to a 2266. Honda spot, it taking out the fast fish. Ooh, fast fish. All right, this ought to be a good one. I got the Escalade. I'm gonna put the Escalade over here in lane one. Going up against the Mustang in lane two, right here. Both of these cars right here have won or placed, shown well. Ready, set, go. And multiple tracks, 2232 to a 2266. That extra weight helping that big Escalade. That's a 34 thousandths beat right there. 34 thousandths beat for the big old Escalade. All right, 
swap them up. Yeah, I've seen both of those cars do pretty well on some tracks. Ready, set, go. Escalade went right around in 2235, 2286. All right, Escalade moving on. Oh, Mustang. Retired. There's your final eight right here. Let's do it. Corvette, 16 Angels. Let's see what happens. 16 Angels in lane one. Corvette in lane two. Did not really expect that Corvette to get this far, but here he is. Ready, set, go. Man, he's quick on that straight. Trying to catch up to him. 22-28 to a 22-41. So that's a 13 thousandths beat right there for Mr. 16 Angels. 13 thousandths beat. We'll put him over here in lane one. 16 Angels in lane two. FTE tournament. Ready, set, go. Woo, that was close. 13 thousandths, 27. What is that? Three. Only got him by nine. Only got him by nine. All right. 16 Angels, the bigger beat in the first round. Moving on to the final four. Corvette, not bad though. Charger, Camaro. Both of them with these trap fives are liable to both drive right off the track and right into the floor, who knows. Ready, set, go. Charger, 2237 to a 2255. 18,000's beat right there for the Charger. I think the only cars that really come off this track are these track fives. Since I've had the track out here and have had it redone with the new, with the new uh, track surface that uh, Scale gave me, I've only had one car come off. Ready, set, go. So I guess I'm due for a car to come off. 2246 to a 2266. Good showing by the lightweight right there. Nice showing right there. But the Charger's gonna move on. It's always something when these cars come off. I'm kind of surprised. Most of the time they hit the floor because I got fumble fingers. Bon Voyage. Porsche Carrera. Porsche Carrera in lane one. Bon Voyage in lane two. Get a little debris right there on the track. Ready, set, go. Bon Voyage went around him by two thousandths. Look at that. Straighten up my bag a little bit. Two, two, five, seven to a two, two, five, nine. Two thousandths win for the Bon Voyage. Let's put him over here in this lane. And the Carrera over here in lane two. Ready, set, go. Close. 2251 to a 2263, 12,000's beat. All right, I guess I timed out a little bit. There you go. Bon Voyage moves on. We'll continue on. Escalade, Honda Spocket. Honda Spocket in lane one. Escalade in lane two. Ready, set, go. Oh, look at the Escalade. 22.27 to a 22.33. Six thousandths. Six thousandths beat right there for the Escalade. Let's swap them up. Oh, Escalade, oh, heavy right there. Going against the Spocket. Ready, set, go. Oh, he's gonna hold. Oh, the Honda Spocket came back. 47 to a 49. Wow. Wow, the Honda Spocket took it right there at the end. But not enough. Good showing by the Spocket. That's pretty cool right there. All right, here's your final four. The two heaviest cards are in it. Let's see what happens. Gonna put the Charger. Trap fives and all in lane one against the 16 Angels. Ready, set, go. 
16 angels got him by two thousandths. A 35 to a 37. Is that what I saw? Yes, sir. Two thousandths for the 16 angels. Swap them up here. 16 angels in lane one. And the charger in lane two. Ready, set, go. 16 angels going to take it. Going to go to the finals. 22-27 to a 22-41. So 16 angels. Good showing right there by the charger, though. Impressive. Bon Voyage versus the Escalade. Bon Voyage got a tough way to go right here. Going up against the Escalade. Ready, set, go. Escalade 2244 to a 2253. So that is going to be a, what is that? A nine thousandths beat for the Escalade. Escalade, nine thousandths up on the Bon Voyage. Whoops, let's see what happens. Ready, set, go. And the Escalade, 2238 to a 2261. So, looks like the Escalade is going to take on the 16 Angels. Here we go. Let's see what happens. 16 Angels or Escalade. Both the heaviest two cars that we have in the bunch. Ready, set, go. Escalade 2219 to a 2227. Wow. Escalade getting it done right there. Eight thousandths. Let's swap them up. Eight thousandths for the Escalade. All right, here we go. 16 Angels, hard to put him up there. Get him straight, ready, set, go. Escalade got it, 2238 to 2245. So the Escalade is gonna be the winner. He was probably everybody's choice anyway. A little bit heavier than those other guys. He goes up against this case right here. Let's see if he can get in. See what he can do. See how far he can go. I don't think he's going to get in the other one. Gatekeeper. Right there. Your gatekeeper, the X-Side. X-Side car. Thunderbird. Let's see what happens. Can he knock him out? Ready, set, go. Whoa, not so fast. Twelve thousandths. Twelve thousandths for this guy right here. Look at that. Let's see what happens in this other lane. He's up by 12. He may not even let him in the case. May not even let him in. Ready, set, go. Look at that right there. All that work and 22.19 to a 22.32. All that work. And your FTEs, at least your champion right there, not going to make it in. Not, I'm not even talking to the top 48. I'm talking about to the weight class. That's a tough weight class right there. I'll race some of these others and see if we can get any under this 35 and under. I'll have to re a bunch of them. We'll see if we get some in. I'll let you know about that in just a second. All right, FTE lovers. All of these FTE cars... Did not make it in. I did run, where's he at? 16 Angels against the Gatekeeper in that weight, other weight class. Did not get in. This car was already out. These four right here got knocked out. Let me show you who made it in. Porsche Carrera, now the Gatekeeper. The little Camaro that could is in here. Second from the bottom. Bon Voyage made it in. And the winner of the day, I guess it would be this uh, this Corvette, this green Corvette made it pretty good, pretty good way up here in the case. But that's it, folks. That is it. So you be the judge on the FTEs. Are they worth it? Are they not worth it? If you're a hater, you're going to love it. You're probably going to say they're terrible. Never buy them. Not worth it. 
they have some pretty cool cars. I mean, they got some good looks to them. But anyway, that's it. That's all I got for you. DXP Diecast Racing. Hope you enjoyed the FTE 32 car tournament. But you can see, are they really faster than ever? Or are they not faster than ever? You be the judge. See you on the track.